It is a night to remember for high school students, prom night. But the big night can put a big dent in your wallet, especially if you're searching for a dress. Our Stephanie Poole went dress shopping with some local students today, and all of these dresses were free. She joins us in the studio with that story. That's right, Andrea. While going to prom can make for an exciting high school tradition, it can be extremely costly. That's why Dresses of Hope is visiting high school to try to take some of that stress away. There comes a time in every girl's life to dress up for prom. Here's me in my dress back in 2014. While going to the dance is simple, the hardest part can be finding a gown. I have wanted to go to prom since I was in elementary school. Like always seeing all my older friends and my cousins and stuff go to prom, it's just like, I don't know, for some reason it's, it's like a rite of passage. Like you always wanted to do that growing up and I cannot wait to be able to do that in two weeks from now. Megan Lohman is a junior at Starkville High School. She says if it wasn't for dresses of hope, she might not have found anything to wear. I'm so excited. This is the prettiest dress that I've ever found, and I'm so glad I didn't have to spend any money on it. And, like, now I don't have to worry about it. I can just worry about my hair and my nails, and I cannot wait to wear this. It's going to be so pretty. Students like Loman are trying on dresses in hopes to find the perfect fit. Yeah, I really found my dress, like, the first time, but I wanted to look some more so I can have options, but I found my dress. Board President Laura Turner says there's dozens of dresses, shoes, and accessories to choose from. The catch is, everything is free. We collect used and unwanted prom dresses in Startville, um, whether that's from college girls or just people from our hometowns that want to donate dresses. A lot of them like still have the price tags on and they're super nice dresses, and so it does just kind of save them um, a trip traveling around trying to find dresses if they can't find one in Startville. I wasn't actually like looking for a dress. I was just kind of going with my friends. I ended up finding one, which is great, so now I don't have to shop. I was actually shopping online, and I was really struggling, so I'm glad I was here. Now, Loman and her class classmates are off to make memories that will last a lifetime. I'm really excited because this is my first year going to prom. This is my last year of high school. I love that y'all are doing this for us because, you know, some people never had the opportunity to go to prom. The next stop for Dresses of Hope is at Louisville High School.